Welcome to the mansion's original foyer as conceived for the Gracie family and reinvented with historic zeal in 1982. The first of Catalyst's seven artworks is the photo Warren, owner, Hunts Point, from the South Bronx trade series of Martine Fougeron. Fougeron's work highlighting small businesses in the Bronx can also be seen in the Susan E. Wagner Wing foyer. Next, SOS, Free Seeds Library, by Tat Fu Tan. It reveals the artist's creative process spanning ecology, health, and climate change. Modeled on the Little Free Library system, these totemic public sculptures provide free seeds to New Yorkers. Besides this one, under the stairs, there are four boxes at accessible points outside. When coming in person, all are urged to take a seed packet and plant them at home. Across is the original Earth Day poster by Robert Rauschenberg, who created it for the first Earth Day some 50 years ago in 1970. His bold statement places the bald eagle, symbolizing the United States, at the center and surrounds the bird with multiple images of environmental damage. Next, Going to Work by Perla de Leon dates back to 1980, when she was photographing the South Bronx De Leon knew the neighborhood from childhood and found its surviving vitality by showing a stylish woman whose daily agency contradicts the depressed community she strides through. Below is Lorraine O'Grady's Art Is Troop Front, joyously celebrating avant-garde art making at the 1983 African American Day Parade when the artist directed 15 young women dressed in white to hold gilt frames. This invited the parade onlookers to see them each as a proud, distinct portrait. At the bottom of the vertical array is Meryl Latterman Eucles during her 1979 milestone performance, Touch Sanitation. It was her first collaborative piece as inaugural artist in residence with the New York City Department of Sanitation. It proved to be an unexpected and unprecedented unification of art and essential public service. Last at the bottom of the elegant residence stairs is The Cup by Elizabeth Columba. This artist reclaims historical narrative by presenting men and women of color as heroic figures in the traditional figurative canon of Western art history. Columba describes her intent, quote, to redefine not only how black people have been conditioned to exist, but also how they have been conditioned to reflect upon themselves. And that will conclude our tour of the foyer. In the next video, we will explore the library, which combines eight pieces of art from Catalyst.